Yo, what's up YouTube and welcome back to another FIFA 22 video. Now, tonight's video is more about investing. This is for longer sort of, uh, you know, transitions of making money. Now, there is semi bits that you need to be club stocking. So if you do have a lot of coins, definitely a good method to do so. If you don't have so many coins, okay, maybe go and check out some of my other videos. Get yourself a nice little coin balance of maybe 150k plus okay and then come back and do some of these methods because these here are the ones that you need to be making that money okay um once you've got it it's very very easy to make more but it's from getting from 1k to 100k so it is quite hard to do so just bear that in mind okay but this is more for the higher tier sort of trading uh i will definitely drop a lower tier again at some point i did just drop one a couple days ago for you so make sure you go and check it out so if you're new around here go and hit that sub button okay guys we're on our way to seven thousand subs which is huge okay also let's see if we can hit 150 likes in the first 24 hours of this video going live if you don't hit that like button you guys are gonna have terrible pat luck so what we're gonna be talking about we're gonna catch up quickly okay and unfortunately i did record the video but i recorded it with no sound so I did just discard the cards that I was talking about. But if you check out one of my other videos, okay, you've got cards like this here. Now, I've actually been selling these for about 700, 750 coins. And I've been picking up for 350. So I'm doing this throughout the day. I don't want to go too much into this because I've got so many things to talk about in this video. Okay. Um, so you need to be picking those cards up and selling them on. What is just sold? Let's have a quick look. Okay, it's not really telling me. So there you go. So something's just gone. I'm not too sure. Okay, my basic card, sweet. That's another sniping method, guys. You can pick them up for 1.2 or less. They will sell at 1.4. So, obviously, okay, we all know that the uh, Team of the Week packs have come out. We did get that leak quite early. We did prep for them. We did quite well. But there's a reason why these packs come out, okay? Now, what EA is doing is EA is getting you to spend all your clubs, okay, all your cards from your clubs into these SBCs. Now, the reason they do that is because then you have to buy FIFA points on this promo coming on Friday, okay? Then you uh, you obviously spend more money and you've got less packs. Now, the reason they're going to do that, okay, is because they might bring certain cows out. And we're thinking League SBCs. Now, we're going to talk about League SBCs in a minute. But before that, we need to talk about the informs. <laughs> so, if we go and have a quick look, okay? Now, all these informs are being packed. People are getting duplicates and they're selling off their other informs, okay? Their tradable informs. Now, cards like this here, okay, are actually down in price, okay? Because so many people are packing them, okay? They're packing them and they're selling their tradables. Now, this card here, Janabri, okay, was up to about 35k before this promo come out. Now, if you look, he's actually down at 25k and less, now, if you can, okay, and this is people that's got some serious money. And this this is just me saying, you know, if you want to make more money, pick up some of these cards now while they're cheap. Because once this pack's gone in 24 hours, these prices will rise, okay? Obviously, sell when you're happy. But kind of like, these are like short-term sort of investments. Now, as you see, I'm at 56,000 coins. That's because I'm invested in other things. I've got a million coins to play with. Uh, and I will, be, I will probably be back at about 500k... Uh, in the next 24 hours once I've sold off some of those investments. I've just spent an absolute bomb on club stocking. But I'll show you exactly what I've done in a second. So cards like this, okay. And then you've got cards like Dest. Okay, now Dest obviously is another card that is uh, obviously team of the week. Again, normal sort of meta card. Again, once this comes back out, this will go back up to about 30, 35k. You're going to make yourself about 5k, maybe more, depending on what sort of card it is and what league and, you know, nation and that sort of stuff. So, we're going for the meta cards, okay? Obviously, you've got Fatty is another one, okay? Let's go and have a check on him real quick. Um, we'll put that down to there. Again, as you see, he now he's actually probably a really good card to be going for because he's down under 15k. And as you see, you might even be able to pick him up at about 13,000 coins. Now, if you can, I would pick up a couple of these because I can see him rising back up to about 16,000 coins just with this. Now, I'm actually going to pick that one up. No, I'm not. Because I feel like you're not going to get much lower than that, boys. Okay, as you see, yeah, below 15,000 coins. So, one of these here, maybe two, you're going to make about five or six K profit. I mean, just going by, obviously, the demand so much right now for informs is so high. And from previous out-of-pack cards, these cards are dropping. They will go back up 100%. Okay, there's no ifs, but or maybes. They are 100% going up. Now, again, you look at Depay, okay? 
Let's just clear that. We'll just have a quick look at some of these cards. Now, again, he's sitting around 60k, 55,000 coins. I guarantee we can probably pick him up at 50,000 if we quickly go and have a look. Okay. Oh, I didn't select 50,000. What a donut. Okay, so we're going to go to 50,000. Let's try again. There we go. Bosh. He's actually around 50k. This card here is so highly used that that should be a lot more. Now, again, uh, another one is for Mino, okay? Obviously, for the Premier League. This here is going to be another good card that's going to be popping up and down. Um, where's M? There it is. So, for Mino, again, let's clear that out. There you go. Now, he's actually um, down at like 40,000 coins. You're not going to get many of these Premier League 86 rated cards that much cheaper and uh oh, what was that was that oh that was 49 okay i thought i said 39 then jeez i mean as you see there's not that many on the market either so this card's kind of round oh okay, okay there's quite a few here uh i thought it was quite rare because we got to 40 minutes pretty quick okay i mean there's there's loads of them chesney rafinha uh undumbele okay let's go and check him out real quick um these cards here they're just absolutely low in price and, and we should be taking full advantage of it okay as you can see here he's probably at about that 15 16k uh th that there gives you some strong links into any of your french teams uh obviously your premier league teams okay um i mean this is sort of cards that people are going to go for uh you know hernandez let's go and check that guy out real quick okay because again um he is going to be another card no it's not that guy this is going to be the one that takes me forever to find, doesn't it? Uh, and then there's... Okay, so we're looking at like... Was it Lucas that got one? No, it wasn't Lucas. <laughs> Come on now. Oh, which Hernandez is it? I wrote it down and I've literally... I've not done anything else with it. Uh, was it N? There's... Okay, so let's go and have a quick look. Was it Theo? I think it was Theo, wasn't it? Yeah, of course it was. <laughs> this is another sort of card. I mean, obviously this one's a bit higher, but it's going to be packed quite a bit. And this price is going to be coming down. Now, what are we looking at for this card? Like 200k? Less than that. Okay, we're looking at like maybe 170, 160. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, about 175 possibly. Yeah. So, I mean, this is another card that you're going to be able to pick up. Again, if you can pick them up on a bid, I mean, you're going to get them even cheaper. Just hold on and send them off to the, the transfer list and then sell them when they're gone again. So, it's cards like that that are going to make you some money. Now, again, like I said, if you've got a 1,000 coins, obviously this video is not for you, okay? But a lot of my community should have a couple million coins now. I mean, I'm at 2 million transfer profit and I literally trade 45, uh, 45 minutes a day. Uh, apart from weekends when I was live streaming over on Twitch, I was obviously, I did quite a bit. But um, yeah, these are cards that you are going to make money. Now, once you've got that money, it's easier to make more money because you've got more money to spend, blah, blah, blah. Obviously, common sense. So now this is where you guys need to be going, right, okay, I've got 500k, I've got 200k, I've got 400k. Where can I make more money? And the overnight flipping and holding of cards are a very, very good way of doing it. Now, don't go buying loads of Theos. Don't go buying loads of Deaths or Fatties. Spread them out a bit, okay? Go for different leagues, different nations, different, different clubs. Obviously, you don't want everything all in the same basket. Never put all your eggs in the same basket. Don't go just for Premier League or La Liga. Split it up because an SBC may come out where some of those cards go boof, straight up. And you're missing out because you just bought loads in the same league. However, that could, you know, work in your favor. Let's say you bought loads of Prem and the Prem League was required. You make a ton of money. But the chances of it is very, very low. So, I've told you that. Probably some of you are going like, hey, Dean, I've just bought 200 fatties. I mean, impossible to do. But you just bought 200 fatties. Uh, when's he going to go up? Don't know. Can't tell you. Can't tell you when this is going to happen. But I can tell you it will happen. It will make you money. So the next thing, okay, obviously everyone's spunking their cards now, okay? They're getting rid of them. Your clubs are going to be empty. Now, I've only done one Team of the Week SBC, and I switched on very, very quick that most of these cards are very low. I think it's something like nine cards over 20,000 coins, and it costs you 13,000 to make. You are wasting money on this SBC. So... Why are they doing it? Because they want the packs, okay? They want those packs to be bought, which means the clubs are going to be empty. They want you to spend money to get more players to then do SPCs. It's all there, okay? It's all money related. Now, they're going to drop, you know, league SPCs soon, if not very, very soon. 
So you want to look at cards that you can make money on, okay? Now, let's go to Premier League. If you're in my Discord, I would have already shown you. I've got a little link where you can go, okay? I will update it for all the other leagues. Now, Premier League are not guaranteed to come first. It's impossible to tell you which league's going to come first because they mix it up every year, okay? But what you need to go is you need to go for the newly uh, relegated clubs or, sort of, you know, promoted clubs that are in the Premier League, okay? So stuff like Brentford because they're more silver cards and bronze cards than gold. And that's what we're going to be hitting up, okay? Because these gold players, yeah, the gold rares are quite high. I would club stock on them as well. I'm not saying stay away from them. But you need to mainly focus on the silvers, okay? And then you need to look at the right backs, left backs, centre backs, right mids, left mids. Now, anyone that's played FIFA before will know, okay, that these sort of cards are high in price. Uh, and they are required because you need 95 rated chemistry. So as you see here, okay, this guy is already high in price. Look at it. And there's very, very little on him. Now, there could be a reason because this is a right wing card. Okay, so let's go and quickly check his right wing. Uh, does that save the price there? There you go. So we know that that card, okay, is a right wing. So what you could do is now go and pick up two of them. If you know that they're up, Bush, I know, okay, that this card here is going to go up to about 2,000 coins plus, okay, when that league SBC comes out. So I'm going to buy one here at 350. I wouldn't buy it normally like that. I would bid on it. But because I'm uploading a video... I know that for the next couple of days, I'm probably not going to be able to get a card much cheaper than that. Um, so I'm going to buy it there. Okay. And then if you go to silver, okay, that's the next thing we could do is then just fill it into silver. Okay. And we want to go and find what the cheapest silver is. Uh, because I'm sat on a million coins, I would like to kind of go with the fact I will like to double up on each position because I want to do the SBC, but I also want to make money while doing it. So if I can buy two cards... Save them both in the club, okay? Not transfer this because that could take a while. This, I mean, if you just bulk on the uh, <coughs> on the Premier League and it's the last one to drop, you, you could be holding cards for two months or a month. So this is why. You are literally putting these in your club and forgetting about them. Don't submit them into SBCs. You can try and trade with them now. But as you see, okay, this here is going to be a high demand card when this SBC comes out. Again, obviously, let's go and look at left back, okay? We want to quickly see what these are. Again, we're looking at 2,000 coins already. And I know these, these these cards, I mean, I've I've had to buy cards at 10,000. At some point, at some point, sorry, I've got hiccups. At some point, you've had to snipe cards just to get it. Not to make money, just to get it to complete the SBC. So people will pay out their back end for these cards, Okay. But if you can get in there nice and early, 2k now seems quite a bit. But when you're selling them on for 10,000 coins, okay, you are going to be laughing your way to the coin bank, okay? And it's the same. So we look at Brentford, okay? Let's look at Brighton. Again, another one. Let's go and have a look at these players here. As you can see, there is a ton of players. So you just want to stock up on these. Now, obviously, try and bid on them. Try and get them as cheap as you can. Now, if you can get any of these cards... For literally less than 400 coins, you are going to be making money, okay? Again, let's go and quickly clear all that up. You've got bronze cards as well. As you can see, silver are already higher than the golds. And the reason that is because people don't open silver packs. There's less supply, high demand, okay? And the minute they are required, which is super high, you are then screwed. Because you probably will not get those cards, okay? Uh, and if you like me, I like to complete SBCs. I like to make money. So I'm going to do both, which will basically fund my SBC for free, which then means I get all the packs. Now, it depends if they give you a player at the end of the end of the, the league, like they have done previously, or like last FIFA where they gave you packs during each one. Uh, I would prefer that because obviously my packs are then kind of funded for free. I think you work it out as you can get something like uh, it's about 250k worth of packs or maybe 500k, but the SBC is going to cost you 300k. So it's definitely worth doing this, okay? So obviously Brighton, Brentford, Burnley's another one, okay? These are your first main five. Uh, as you see there, I mean, I'd definitely be picking some of those up if I was you. Uh, which, which other ones? There's Wolves, okay? Wolverhampton. Uh, where are they? There they are. Watford's another one, okay? Like, you need to be picking these cards up. Uh, again, back down to Norwich. I mean, these are full silver, okay? There's only a few golds in the Norwich team. 
and then the rest are silver cards. So this is a very high ratio of silver cards. And, and again, I've stocked up on these, so there's no point in buying any of these. I've literally got the entire Norwich team, uh, Wolves team, Burnley team. The only one I didn't really do was Brentford, which I will do as this video is uploading, okay? So as you can see, there's them. But you also have all the other leagues, okay? So you have the La Liga, Bundesliga, Championship 2 is another big one that they can drop. Now, you don't get amazing packs from it, but you do get packs. Uh, obviously, the uh, Chinese League, not Chinese, sorry, the um, Japan League, okay? They normally drop that as a league SBC. Not really worth doing, but you can pick up um, bronze cards for 200 coins. Now, if you can get these in good positions, okay, let's say left backs and right backs, uh, these cards will potentially go for, um, you know, absolute ridiculous money because people will do these cards so again if you go here like you can literally bid on all these for 150 coins you could potentially spend about maybe five six thousand in this league make yourself nearly you know nearly a hundred thousand coins it's ridiculous how much money you can make from this uh from this method okay a lot of people will be doing this method as well now again like i said don't make make sure you don't duplicate buy the same card okay because once you do that you're screwed because you will be, uh, you just be wasting money. People ain't gonna buy these cards right now. Uh, so again, like, what else is there? They normally drop uh, the Liberators, okay? Uh, what's the other one? There's another one that they normally drop. I can't remember what league it is. But you can always look on Footbin and see what the last lot was. So hopefully that kind of helps you. I know it's not a trading method to make you money right now. Uh, there's a lot of a lot of stuff out there that you can make money if you if you need to make money right now Go and check out some of my other videos. Some of them are absolutely flying right now with with uh, profit making ways You can do shadow trade and 10 10 20 30 methods. There's you know the consumable stadium staff uh, Left back silver trading right back silver trading bronze trading I mean, there's so many ways that you can make money just sniping normal cards Okay, uh, 83 rated cards right now are quite high as well. I mean, you can pick some of these up quite low. I mean, look at Jesus. You could probably pick him up for about 1.4, send him on for about 1.8. There's just, there's so many ways to make money right now. This FIFA is really enjoyable for the content that they keep lobbing out. But don't fall, don't fall victim for their, their plans, okay? Don't go emptying your club without thinking about restocking it, okay? Because when these SPCs come out, you're going to be the reason why we make money, okay? Because you're going to be the people that have emptied your club and are going to be buying these players because you haven't invested in them. So play it smart. Play it smart, play it big, make big money. Right, with that said though, guys, I'm going to end the video there because it's 17 minutes of me waffling on and that is a long time for anyone. But make sure you join my Discord, join my Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all that good stuff, Twitch, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.